Well, that's, that's obviously going to be really frustrating for you. What, what went wrong this afternoon? Um, obviously, you know, the goals. The goals are, are a little bit sloppy from us. Um, it's not just de- uh, blaming the defenders or individual mistakes. Um, I think it's very important that we uh, get the message across that we attack as a team. And that's everyone attacks and we defend as a team. So, listen, the, the lads in there have been absolutely a joy to work with and fantastic. And um, it's, a, it's a bit of blow. It's a bit of blow coming the end of the season. You know, it would have put the icing really on the cake. But let's not forget what this group of players have gone and achieved, and that's winning four Premier Leagues in a row, which no other team has been able to do. Pep Guardiola said in his press conference he got it tactically wrong today. What, what do you think he meant by that? He's the last man I'm going to question on tactics um, because he's a genius for what he's done. For the years that I've been here, how he's transformed me as a player, how he's transformed you know, some of them players in there as, as players. You know, If he says that, then you know that's down to him and what he says. But you know, for me, it's down to it's the whole squad. You know, We've got 97 minutes to uh, go and win a game of football. Um, so for me, you know, we all take accountability for that. Uh, tomorrow you will go and celebrate the parade at the, the Premier League trophy yeah. with, with your fans in Manchester. Yeah. I, I know you'll want to say, importantly, it has been a successful season for City, even though the double-doubles escaped you today. No, of course, and the double-doubles never been done. That's why it's so hard. Um, four in the row has never been done until we've done it. So we will celebrate with our fans. I think it's right to celebrate with our fans. Would I have wanted it off of the back of this result? Of course not. Uh, I'd have liked to make them extra proud, but hopefully for what we've achieved, you know, as a group of players this year, then coming off of the back of the treble, hopefully they're satisfied with that and they'll show their support, you know, tomorrow as I know they always will do. <clears throat> and, and we'll be there to show, you know, our appreciation for their support over the season. Any just finally from me, any any doubt in your mind that the title celebrations from last weekend played a part in today? No, no. Um, we, we celebrated on Sunday. This is on Saturday. It's six days. Um, if athletes can't recover in six days, then we've got no chance for everyone, have we? Um, so listen, we had to take that moment then because if we're celebrating now on a downer, it's not really going to feel right. So I think the moment was right. Um, the club, you know, the players and the staff made that decision. And so let's not blame that. You know, that's down to us as a group of players. And as you know, who was playing today in that 97 minutes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Can we thoughts on United and the job they did today? No, no um, yeah, it. sorry, I forgot to say. Uh, first of all, you like congratulations to Manchester United for, you know, for winning that trophy. It's probably, you know, this is not me being negative on them. It's probably not been their best of season, but you know, hopefully that's some justification for, you know, some of my friends in there that um, have worked hard, you know, and dealt with a lot of uh, stick recently. And Kobe Mayne, who's going to be a teammate of yours in the summer, isn't he? Oh, well, for England, I mean, it's well, a great for the, for the provisional squad, of course. I'm not the manager, so I don't make them decisions. But um, listen, I think what a talent, what a talent, and the generation of English talent that is coming through is, is very exciting. Um, I think hopefully he can take his form that he's shown over this season from breaking into the into the team, into the to the Euros if selected. And you know, hopefully, as as an England, I'll put my England hat on now. I want a good, I want a good Euros. Thanks, Paul. Thank you. Thank you very much.